hello my beautiful people and welcome back to my channel thank you so so much for being here if you are new to this channel welcome my name is Naomi Shapumba aka Nay the Hustler so in today's video we're going to do something very very exciting um, very very fun so we're going to do an entrepreneur tag this was inspired by a friend um, I've actually tagged her channel in the description box so what we're going to do is we're going to be asking me 10 questions so what I did is I went on Google to actually look for those questions because wow and I actually found out a lot of entrepreneurs don't like doing an entrepreneur tag. So if you are an entrepreneur you are most welcome to steal those questions because I'm going to leave them down below in my description box. So without wasting any time let's just get into it before I start rambling and mumbling and all of that. So I've obviously written it down in my notebook because wow a girl's actually using her phone to record herself so I'm going to be looking down. Please don't mind when I look down I'm actually looking at the questions in this book so let's get started okay so question number one says who tagged you I obviously tagged myself because nobody tagged me um, this was actually inspired by a friend of mine like I said her channel's name is I think it's grow underscore with me but I did mention that I tagged her in the description box so you guys can go check out you know what got me so excited to actually try this tag out and um, number two is who are you and what do you do so my name is Naomi Shapumba aka Nay the hustler I am an entrepreneur I am the founder of Yumi Productions marketing and promotion company. So what we do is we um, provide our clients with staff, you know, event staff, promoters, hosts, hostesses, um, flyer distributor, and so much more really. You can check out our business page. It's at Yomi Productions on Instagram, Yomi Productions on Facebook, and Yomi Promos on Twitter as well. Please do check us out. And then question number three says, how long have you been an entrepreneur? I've been an entrepreneur for four years. In the month of July, Yumi Production actually is going to be turning four years. So it's been quite a long, long time. And then number four, what is your favorite thing about being an entrepreneur? Ah, so my favorite thing about being an entrepreneur is, you know, finding a solution to our client's problem. You know, I'm working with people, obviously. I feel that I am blessed to have such an amazing team that I work with. We've got young, energetic, um, professional team, um, or rather staff at Yumi Productions. So, and also not forgetting, you know, profits, you know, I'm in it for the money. Guys, I know a lot of entrepreneurs entrepreneurs actually shy away from this like we are here to make money let's not just hide from that okay so yeah that's that's the reason why I'm being an entrepreneur amongst all the other reasons so let's go to number five what is your least favorite my least favorite is dealing with difficult clients really because you will find those and if you won't find them they will find you you know sometimes you have to deal with clients who take time to pay you and like I said I work with people and now you need to make payments so it can be quite stressful but it does come with the package so yeah and my other reason is that bookkeeping I don't like I don't like bookkeeping you know when you're an entrepreneur or when you have a business you need to have a book where you record almost everything and you also need to record all your receipts I'll try to do a video about all of that so I don't like doing the bookkeeping I know I did accounting at school I don't even know how I passed accounting because I hate maths I hate numbers but I passed it but you know when you, you're an entrepreneur you can do almost anything you don't need the maths you don't need I'm kidding you guys need to go to school okay don't quote me here and say I said you shouldn't go to school go to school guys but yeah I, I just don't like bookkeeping and difficult clients really those are like my least favorite about being an entrepreneur okay number six says who was the first person your company hired the very first person our company hired was Sakile. Um, it was in 2016. She did a great job because she managed to get us our first client. It was quite exciting. It was nerve wracking because this was our very, very first client that actually said we could get, you know, um, a promo lady to do their work for them and we did a great job. So yeah, it was quite nerve wracking and very, very exciting. Number seven, who are some of your favorite entrepreneurs? So I've got quite a lot. They're actually a mouthful. 
um, but I'm just going to name a few otherwise this video is going to be longer than 30 minutes and I wouldn't want that so the first one being um, Oprah I love Oprah and I also love Gary V I also love Dan Lok, DJ Spoo, Vusi Tembewayo, Hattie the Entrepreneur, Lebu Lion I did say if I was gonna mention all of them it was going to take 30 minutes or more than that and if I had to mention why I love those people it's even going to be longer but they're actually more than that I also love Mpumile Dwaba I love her so so much and I watch her channel so yeah and by eight says where do you get your best work done I get my best work done when I'm in bed like it's so weird it's so strange you know some people get their work done in restaurants in their car in their office and for me it's when i go to bed when i go to bed and i have this great idea you know i just get my notepad and i write all this idea because you never know you might have this great idea tonight before you sleep and when you wake up tomorrow it's gone so i normally get the best work done in my bed so yeah and then let's go to number nine number nine says what do you wear on a daily basis <laughs> <laughs> um i'm a very comfortable person i like being comfortable so when i started me productions people would tell me i needed to look classy and bougie and wear all heels and all of that and um, i thank god that i really quickly snapped out of it and i realized that it's okay to be your own person it's okay to dress the way you want it's okay to be um comfortable you know you know that a lot of millionaires that i know that don't even look like millionaires you know what i'm saying so i'm so glad i snapped out of that uh, basically what i'm saying is i wear whatever is comfortable smart casual i don't mind wearing my pair of jeans and flip-flops and a t-shirt and just do my thing girl do my thing it's all about being comfortable um it's okay to be your own person at the end of the day so yeah i would say a smart casual because when i have meetings obviously i need to look a little bit serious so i do wear my dresses and my heels then but otherwise comfortable clothes is for me so let's go to okay question number 10 says what advice would you give to anyone who would like to start a business my advice to anyone who would like to start a business is to just start guys just start because if you're going to wait until you have the right capital the right money the right resources you are never going to start there's no perfect time um this actually takes me back to the time when when i wanted to start my youtube channel i'd ask you know above on guy how to start a channel and what i need their reply would be just start and i felt very very you know i got in my feelings <laughs> because i was expecting something more you know like you need this you need that you need you know because what what you really need to start a youtube channel is basically your phone so and then i also realized it's the same when it comes to business if you're going to wait until when you're ready it's never going to happen people are always going to have their own opinion they're always going to say their own things and it's got nothing to do with you and always remember my brother my sister people who boo at concerts are people who paid for the cheapest seats okay so do your thing if you want to start a business go ahead my friend you are most welcome okay guys this is all i have for you guys today i hope this video was as much fun and as exciting as it was for me i hope you really really enjoyed it please do comment down below and let me know which question was your favorite or which which answer was your favorite i really really love to hear from you and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click on the notification bell so that every time i upload a video you will be notified but don't forget to follow me on instagram at naomi underscore yomi and also follow me um on twitter at naomi naomi as i'll leave all my handles down below also do kindly check out our business page and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you so so much for watching bye guys